To Lover's Point. It is said this land was founded upon these two lovers. I can't think of anything funny right now. Fuck it. And then, uh, so then, uh, they were they were forbidden to like see each other and ran away together. And then they chased him. And then, like, they chased him up this cliff because they wanted to just do nothing but love each other. And they tied their hair together. And. Uh, and leapt off. There's already been a casualty. This might be the bluest water I have ever seen before. Whoa. Falls right now, Guam, USA. Let's see what it has to offer us. Oh look, there's guns. Let's shoot them. Yo, check this out. I wish I could read that. It says, bring big gun, shoot, kill. Shooting. What a ridiculous photo. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Behind me is some sort of man. Why is he sad? Why is he in a cave? I don't know. Dwayne, why is this man... What's up with this? The Japanese occupied this island. The United States came through here and got him off the island. But not everybody got the message. He didn't surrender. He didn't know the Japanese surrendered. He was hiding out in the jungle for years. He dug a hole. And I guess he lived in the hole for 20 years. And he probably didn't have good Wi-Fi down there. Yeah. Chip. Hey. Go chip chip. This little guy has shit on his face. That is shit. We got the ghost house Guam edition. I kind of want to go in. Uh, construction we have going on here. Looks like we got a. Uh, seems pretty solid. Solid roof yeah. foundation. Yeah. State of the art rail system with welded on lawn chairs. The hole that you just saw had a soldier in it for 28 years because he thought the war wasn't over. He was kind of. Being in Guam is like being in a totally different country. There is pretty much nothing that looks familiar to me here. Is it just me or does Gucci have the most evil building I have ever seen in my life? In Guam, I met a professional drone pilot. His name was Maverick. And from what I'm told, he's the best. Oh, fire, dude. So, behind me are the beautiful waters of Guam. Now, I've been here for about three days now. I've learned there are a ton of bars, a lot of massage parlors, and giant stealth fighters 
also. The water is pretty nice as well. Let's check it out.